Good evening. Hello, everyone. I'm PJ. Welcome to Grace Holland Rabbit Tree. Uh, this evening, I'm going through and I'm updating you on all my brood stock. Um, I'm a little buck heavy right now, which <laughs> tends to be the way I run. Uh, I typically like to keep one buck for uh, two does. Uh, that way I can have some variety. Uh, however, right now I am running uh, pretty buck heavy. We've gone through and I've showed you the reds and they've shown you the blues. And now last and finally, let's go through and I'm going to give you an update on the blacks. All right, we're losing a little bit of daylight now, um, at least in the barn. It's starting to get dark. Uh, so, um, good thing we're on black, because you can see a big glob of black here, uh, and this <laughs> this nice, well-formed glob of black here is Mina, and uh, she's had uh, a couple of litters with me now. She's a good mom. Uh, she's currently raising nine. Uh, she had a litter of 11, and two of those were peanuts who did not grow um, and those are the first peanuts she's had uh, so uh, she's done very well and uh, she does not carry blue and so she is used in the black program and uh, most likely I will most likely I will move out of blacks and broken blacks and focus more on blues and reds and broken blue broken red and so I'm gonna keep these uh, blacks and I'm going to breed them to blue to get some blue carriers and then most likely all of these that I'm discussing today is probably going to move out um, by the end of next year at least uh, some of these uh, by the end of this year uh, but here's Mina and uh, uh, she's actually have a black litter now. Um, she was bred to Ogden. And so um, all of her kits will be up for sale because they're not going to carry blue. Of course, they're only two weeks old, so it's going to be a while. Uh, and then uh, I'm going to breed Mina uh, to Kirby or uh, some other blue buck if I happen to find one. And then we'll keep a doe out of her. And probably by spring, Mina will be available uh, to help someone else in their rabbitry. And she is a Mina. Okay. No, she's not a registered Grand Champion. She is registered and she has two legs. That's a very nice doe and an excellent mom. All right. And then here we have our friendly um, black buck, uh, Ogden. And uh, Ogden, we found out, carries uh, um, a little bit of white in him. He has thrown white in his last litter. Um, Ogden does not, however, carry dilute. And so he will never produce uh, blues for me that I'm aware of. And since I will soon be getting out of the blacks, um, you know, I, I really don't have a use for Ogden anymore. Now, Ogden is a very nice buck. He's got excellent muscle tone. Uh, you can see he's quite friendly, uh, hanging out of his cage to be petted. <laughs> he, he's just a lovely old buck. Um, awesome muscle tone. He's got a nice body. He's got a beautiful black color. Um, Ogden came to me from Minnesota. Uh, he's you know, one of the national breeders, I purchased him from him. And so um, I'm sad to see this fella go, but he's just not going to fit in my program anymore. Uh, so um, Ogden will probably be available. And uh, yeah, he'll, he'll be available for anyone that needs a super nice buck uh, in their program. Isn't that right, Ogden? Are you going to go to sleep? That does not look comfortable. And you are just, look at him. He's just like dozing off there, taking him a little nap. He just loves that. Look at him. <laughs> oh, he's so wonderful. Look at you. 
Okay, I need to close your door. Come on. Get back in your cage. There you go. All right, and here is Zion. Uh, Zion is a registered grand champion, and uh, she does not carry blue. And so she will be uh, looking for a new home uh, as soon as um, I get her bred to a blue buck. And we have a litter out of her, and I will keep a uh, black doe uh, from her that carries the blue gene or the loot. Alrighty then, here is our big, big, big blue doe, or a broken black doe. This is Everlong. Uh, she's out of Ink and Bloomer. Uh, she is a registered grand champion, and she's uh, been a really good mom. She just weaned uh, a litter, and so I plan on breeding her to Kirby uh, to get some uh, blue and blue carriers out of her. Uh, maybe even some br a nice broken blue. Uh, and then once I get some daughters out of her, uh, I will really be finished with her. Uh, by the way, um, Everlong here does have a best in show win. Uh, so she's, you know, a, a, a beautiful doe. Uh, unfortunately, uh, she's just not going to be conduent uh, to my goals in this rabbitry. Uh, so I do hope to get some nice daughters out of her, and then uh, she'll be moved on to uh, another rabbitry uh, to help All someone right. else out. And then we have, oh, I have to think. I moved everyone around today. Shawnee. Uh, Shawnee is out of Ink and Bloomer. Uh, she's the full sister, uh, a younger sister uh, to Shawnee. And she's another really big doe, and so she's going to be bred to my small blue buck and uh, get some daughters out of her. Uh, and Shawnee, let's see, is she registered yet? I'm thinking, no, I think, no, she has all of her legs. Um, I'm waiting, I'm taking her this weekend and try to get her uh, registered and grand championed. She has earned all of her legs. Uh, I just needed to wait for her to turn senior and gain weight uh, in order to meet uh, the standard, which she has done. And so now she's ready to be registered. And then she'll be ready okay. to breed. And then we have the queen, and uh, she is also a registered grand champion. And so... She's waiting on a blue buck, and then we'll get some daughters out of her. Uh, she is out of Dave. Uh, now, I have bred her to a blue buck before, and she had a, a nice litter, but none of them were blue or broken blue. Uh, and I will breed her to a blue buck again. There is a small, very tiny chance that she carries the loot, but so far she has not uh, proved to me that she does. Uh, either way, I'm going to get uh, some babies out of her, and then she'll be ready to move on down the road as well. All right, last but not least is uh, Hero. And Hero is the mother to Daisy, uh, along with uh, she was bred to Dave, and they produced Daisy. Uh, now, Hero is a super nice doe. She is a little on the small side, uh, but she produces good-sized kits. Um, she's got a rear end, super nice. Uh, for a little gal, uh, she's got a nice rear end. Uh, but I plan to breed her to a big blue buck um, whenever I'm fortunate enough to find one. <laughs> And then I will be keeping some daughters out of her. And then Hero 2 uh, will be uh, ready to uh, assist someone else in their breeding program. Hero, why don't you turn around and say hello? Hey, there we go. That would be Hero. Uh, it looks just like Daisy, doesn't she? Even in the face, her eyes... She tells the same story as Daisy. <laughs> Look at her. 
That's hero. Right, so that's it um, for the blacks. Uh, we only have, you know, the one buck um, Ogden, and then two black does, and then six broken black does. Is it six? No, four, four broken black does. Yes, four broken black does, two black does, and one black buck. Uh, I use cash and moco right now as broken black. I do use them in the blue program, uh, but I also use them in the black pr program, or I could uh, if I weren't um, trying to uh, do something else. Uh, anyway, thanks for watching, and until we speak again, God bless.